Have you ever wondered why there is no gravity in space? This is a question that has puzzled many. To answer this, we first need to understand what gravity is. In simple terms, gravity is an invisible force that pulls two objects towards each other. And it's not just a thing here on Earth, it's a universal phenomenon. Think about it like this. When you jump up, you don't keep going up into the sky, right? You come back down. Why? Because our planet, Earth, has a gravitational pull that keeps us grounded, literally. It's this same force that keeps the moon in orbit around the Earth and the Earth in orbit around the Sun. But here's where it gets interesting. You see, gravity isn't just limited to our planet, it's everywhere, even in the vast expanse of space. However, when we talk about space, things get a little more complicated. Let's dive into it. Many people believe that there is no gravity in space, but is that really the case? Let's dive into this interesting question. A common misconception is that there is no gravity in space. In reality, gravity is everywhere. It's a fundamental force that acts between all matter in the universe, holding everything from galaxies to us humans onto the surface of our planet, Earth. The mistake arises from the assumption that gravity is only present where we can feel its effects. But that's not entirely true. Gravity's influence extends throughout space, albeit its strength diminishes as objects get further away from each other. Imagine you're holding two magnets. When they're close, they pull towards each other strongly. But as you move them apart, their attraction weakens. The same principle applies to gravity. It's incredibly strong when you're close to a massive object like the Earth, but get enough distance between you and that object, and you'll feel less of its pull. Now, let's look at the International Space Station, orbiting some 250 miles above Earth. At that altitude, gravity is still about 90% as strong as it is on the surface of the Earth. Yet, astronauts aboard the station float around as if there's no gravity at all. So, if there is gravity in space, why do astronauts float around instead of sticking to the floor of their spacecraft? Scene Script Astronauts float in space because they and their spacecraft are in free fall. Now the term free fall might bring to mind images of skydivers plummeting towards the Earth, but in the context of space, it's a little different. Free fall, as it applies to astronauts and spacecraft, is more about falling towards the Earth while simultaneously moving forward at such a speed that they keep missing it. It's a bit like trying to hit a moving target while you yourself are on a moving platform. Imagine a cannonball being fired from a cannon. If you fire it with just enough force, it will land some distance away. But if you fire it with a lot more force, it will travel a much greater distance before it hits the ground. Now, what if you could fire that cannonball with so much force that by the time it's ready to fall to the ground, the earth has curved away beneath it? That's the essence of free fall in space. The cannonball, or in our case, the astronaut and their spacecraft are constantly falling towards the earth. But because the Earth is also moving, they never quite reach it. They are perpetually caught in this loop of falling but never landing, so they are not really weightless, they are just always falling. Understanding gravity is not just about knowing why astronauts float in space. It's a vital piece of the puzzle, helping us comprehend the fundamental aspects of our universe. Imagine the planets in our solar system. The reason they circle the sun in a predictable, regular pattern is because of gravity. It's the invisible string that keeps them tethered and in line. The same principle applies to the formation of galaxies. It's gravity that pulls together clouds of gas and dust, forming stars and planets. Without gravity, the universe as we know it would be a chaotic, disorganized mess. Gravity also lets us peek into the universe's history. By studying gravitational waves, we can detect events that occurred billions of years ago. Gravity, then, is not just a force that keeps us grounded. It's a key to unlocking the mysteries of our universe. Gravity, in fact, is a key player in the grand scheme of the cosmos. So, to sum up, there is gravity in space. Indeed, this might come as a surprise to many, considering the popular misconception that space is a vast, gravity-free zone. The truth, however, is far from it. The force of gravity does exist in space, it's just that its effects are not as apparent as they are here on Earth. Our journey in this video began with an introduction to gravity. 
We understood the basic tenets of this mysterious force that binds us to the ground and keeps our Earth in its orbit around the Sun. We explored how gravity is not a property exclusive to Earth, but a universal phenomenon that affects every object in the universe, irrespective of its distance from the Earth. Next, we dug deeper into the common misconceptions about gravity in space. We debunked the myth that astronauts in space are weightless because there is no gravity. Instead, we learned that astronauts appear weightless not because there is no gravity in space, but because they are in a state of constant freefall towards the Earth. This led us to the intriguing concept of freefall. It's an interesting phenomenon where objects fall towards each other due to gravity, but because there is no solid ground to stop their fall in space, they keep falling. It's this perpetual falling motion that gives astronauts and objects in space the appearance of weightlessness. Lastly, we discussed the importance of understanding gravity. We stressed how gravity plays a crucial role in everything from the orbits of planets and the tides in our oceans to the very existence of the universe itself. Understanding gravity helps us comprehend the nature of the universe and our place within it. So there you have it. Space is not devoid of gravity. It's just that gravity manifests itself differently in space, leading to phenomena like the free fall and the apparent weightlessness of astronauts. Next time when you see an astronaut floating in space, remember, they're not weightless, they're just falling with style.